Well, this is the last day of the Monument Valley Tour. It's come quickly for most of us who can't really believe that it's gone so quickly. The nice part of it is you can see our adventure in short videos if you haven't figured that already. And they're all going to be in a playlist together in YouTube and then they'll be in other places too. So tonight we are going to do the end of the tour and celebrate it as a fire ceremony. And you're gonna see just a little bit of it. It's a personal time where we actually do some um, in, in, intentions and release in this fire ceremony. So rather than just saying goodbye, I would like to finish this off as we started it with a word for Monica. Thanks for being with us. Hello, beautiful family of light. We have been so blessed this week to be out in the elements of Gaia. We had wind, we had sun, we had sandstorms, you name it, we had it, everything except rain and snow, but I know that somewhere on the planet that too is happening because Gaia is always in balance and we could be in the middle of a storm, but you know what, there is always another place on Gaia that is in this state of balance and beauty and benevolence. One of the favorite quotes I love from Cryon is that when you stand in nature, there is love there and it is unconditional. So I invite you to feel this unconditional love that is here for you. Love and blessings. This last day, there was a final fire ceremony, birthday celebrations, Navajo music and performance, plus some more dancing with the group. You know, it was a great way to finish out this magnificent tour. We gathered for about two hours under the stars. There's nothing quite like a great campfire with friends on this final farewell night. We also honored Marietta and the Navajo guides for their wonderful help. This is the last channel of the tour. Of course, like always, you can find it. Grind.com slash free audio. Here's a final word from our Navajo, Brad Upshaw, the wonderful Goulding's lodge manager. Lastly, we had our own group ceremony where we burned some notes that we had prepared. Some were affirmations and some were for release. Very personal to each person. I sincerely hope you might consider joining us when we do this again. It's one of the few Cryon multi-day tours that's on our own continent. Thank you all for watching.
good night.